Hi guys, today we're going to be making the sun inclinometer. It's a very interesting thing as it allows you to find the angle of the sun as well as angles of the roofs. The first thing we need is a 3D printer. It allows us to print all the parts in orange of the sun inclinometer. You will also need some popsicle sticks, a protractor, two blobs of blue tack, a nut and a bolt, and a small weight to allow it to function properly. The first part is made by assembling the sunbeam as well as the sun targets. So you assemble it with the, the flat side facing the, the sun, like so. Then you put the other uh, sun target in the same place. And then you put the protractor in place. The next thing you want to do is to put the angle measurer in. So you slot it in like this. Then you take the two little orange pieces and you put them in. Now we're going to leave this there and assemble the next part. So you need to take a popsicle stick and drill a hole into it. To make it easier, you put it in like this. Then you take a highlighter and you draw a dot on there, like so. After you've drawn a dot, you can drill a hole in it with a hand drill. So you take your drill popsicle stick and then you put it into the base. You take your first blob of blue tack and use it to put the popsicle stick in place. You slot the popsicle stick into the small hole, then use a nut and bolt and thread it through. You can use a screwdriver to help you tighten it in. Now you assemble the nut onto the bolt, like so. Now you just take the second blob of blue tack and place it onto the bottom of the angle measurer and then you attach the weight to it. So now, once you've finished assembling the sun inclinometer, you can start using it. The first thing you can do is to find the sun and then you have to line it up with the sun. It's going to create two shadows. So you have to align this until it becomes only one shadow. So now you have a fully functioning sun inclinometer. Yeah.